Welcome to St Martin's in the Field, and we're here for their annual space exhibition. Now, this happened in early February, but I wanted to bring it to you because it's an annual event that happens. And to be quite honest, whether you can make it here or not, I can tell you the visuals inside this church are incredible. Now, what it uses is not just the outside of the building, which you can see here, and that's a free exhibition for anyone walking past. They also go into the crypt down below and also go into the church for an amazing amazing demonstration of lights and space and all the rest of it which we're going to bring you between now and the end of this video so stick with us you won't be disappointed because the visual effects are brilliant and if you've ever wondered where you're going to write your equations when you run out of paper and you've got big writing there you go here's the answer write it on the side of a church it's time to go inside from this cold winter night and let's start off with this which looks very star wars-esque and to the very edge of the universe they do. So here we're downstairs in the crypt and they've got three sections all set up. So you saw the first one. Here you've got TV moments shone on a TV placed onto the wall showing the moon landing from 1969. And from this perspective, you've got it as the eagle sort of floats over the moon just about to land. And then on the next piece, You've then got pictures from the surface of the moon. St Martin in the Field is right by Trafalgar Square. It's that big church that overlooks Trafalgar Square. And they really use the space in here well. What I hadn't realized before coming to this exhibition is that they have lots of concerts going on down here and lots of other exhibitions all year round. So if you're coming to London, it's probably worth checking to see what they've got on that's going down here. Now, how about this? Right in the depth of the crypt, you've got, well, what can I say? Complete stars. This star effect is absolutely incredible. So not only have you got it on the floor and on the ceiling and on the, well, the posts of the crypt down below as well, but if you stand in the way, then it shines on you and your bags and your clothes. And it really does look fantastic. And as you can see, you're encouraged to walk around and sort of take in the star vibe, but also worth remembering that a couple of hours beforehand, this was a fully functioning cafe underneath St. Martin in the Fields Church. And how about this for a view? And also, I actually caught some people doing some ballet dancing down there because they wanted the stars on them to film for ballet. Don't ask me why. I suppose you could do anything down there if you fancy stars projected on you. So if you can imagine, all of this is projecting whilst you've got fantastic music related to space playing at the same time. And if you want to catch the sun, that's in one of the little alcoves. Uh, and no, it's not warm. Well, the sun is, but this isn't it particularly. It's quite cold down here, actually. Like so many other people that work or live in London, then you don't actually realize these things go on, yet it's on your doorstep. So if you wanna know for the future, get on the St. Martin in the Fields mailing list. Right, you go from downstairs to the crypt, upstairs into the church and you sit down and you have this 10 minute wonder now what i've done is i've cut certain bits so you can see some of the great effects but this is the inside of the church upstairs now with this we want you to sit back relax and enjoy the universe
and if you're a science fiction fan, this may take you back to the 1970s and a bit of Doctor Who? very cleverly done in the next section is humans exploits to the moon. with the rotating galaxy of the Milky Way. What did you think of space here at St. Martin in the Fields, round by Trafalgar Square? Certainly a different use for the inside of a church. And wow, I've never seen it so full in there. And she was packed to the rafters. So what was your favorite bit? Do let us know in the comments down below as we leave the galaxy spiraling. If you enjoyed that, how about another experience that's currently going on here in London? It's called Frameless and it's art, 40 pieces of art with music in the background where it sort of dissolves. Anyway, it's a really relaxing concept and our video on that is on the top right hand corner. So I'll see you in there.